send chat based messages, location based chat messages, and we are supposed to connect the MK activity. Give the name of the application. So let's first define a user interface. I'll take two test views. I'll take one button. We have one more test view. To align that test view properly. Firstly, we will be longer and second will be stay. Latitudes So I will give text as a get location button. This makes me want to display the address. So we go to coding and define Android text size or GDP and Android. Color, this color, the value and the value. I will select pink for it. Let's see. So I'm getting the view. Okay, now let's move to the next one. In this way, I have defined a method that is get location, which will retrieve the location. Three per these are three permissions which are very much important and later on we will see how to check these permissions are enabled or not here you have to check whether these permissions are enabled or not so if context compact dot check self permission pass the activity here the main we are using main activity so main activity dot this and the permission manifest dot permission dot permission dot Access find location, so this is the permission. Close the bracket. Not equal to package manager dot permission granted. Then you are supposed to assign the permission. Or request the permission so I will request activity compact 
dot request permission main activity dot this comma new string manifest dot permission dot access find location give the code then complete the packet okay so in this way you are going to assign the permission now let us write the code for retrieving the location. We have to define the location manager class. And we have to implement the location listener. Here we have to add all the methods. Click on the implement methods, add all the methods. Okay, now in function, you are supposed to create the object of location manager class. Location manager, get application contest dot get system service. And pass location service as a system service. Then location manager dot request location updates. You have to pass two parameters that four parameters with the GPS provider time limit, distance, and the activity class. Okay, it is returning the error because it requires the permission. So let's see. You can say add add permission check or just missing perm you can add the missing permission annotation. I will add missing permission annotation over here because I have added the permission over here. But you can add the permission check also. So in this way I have added my service. Now I want to work with the location change. I want to check and I want to get retrieve the longitude latitude. So for this purpose, I'm going to use the on location change function. So here, straight away, t1 dot set text plus location dot get longitude and t2 dot set text location dot get latitude now I want to retrieve the actual address with the remote geo geocoding so I will use a class geocoder equal to new geocoder in that pass main activity dot this and with the local get default method I have to add list define the list in that define the addresses Define it as a null. Now use try catch block.
is this define the address address is equal to geocoder dot get from location pass location dot get longitude comma location Define different thing latitude location dot gate longitude and give my sensor as a one Okay, now next. String address is equal to address dot Use different a w d r address dot gate zeroth location dot gate address line pass zero leg zero and three t three dot set text set this address okay now you need to send the notification and the notification is sent as follows notification compact dot builder define a notification builder is equal to new notification compact dot builder this and define the location id it can be anything dot set content title current location dot set set the icon then dot dot set auto cancel true dot set contain text pass address over here now complete then notification manager notification manager compact Manager is equal to a notification manager compact dot from this and manager dot notify pass any ID and that particular notification that is field dot that is builder dot build. Okay, here also we are supposed to pass the permission and we will pass the permission accordingly. I have to check the version. So 
if build dot version dot SDK is greater than or equal to build dot version course dot find out the twenty six version. Then notification channel is equal to new notification channel location ID comma location comma notification manager complete that uh, double quotes over here notification manager dot importance default Then define notification manager MNGR is equal to date system service notification manager dot class and finally manager dot create notification channel and pass the channel so this is all about the code we will see the output